the enduring legacy of Ahili al-Bayt in science and scholarship. The Ahili al-Bayt, or the family of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, holds a revered position in Islamic tradition, not only for their spiritual and religious significance, but also for their considerable contributions to science and scholarship. Throughout Islamic history, members of the Prophet's family have been instrumental in the development of various fields of knowledge, including theology, philosophy, medicine, astronomy, and literature. This video explores the profound impact of Ahili al-Bayt on science and scholarship, highlighting their enduring legacy. From the dawn of Islam, the family of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, has been a beacon of knowledge and wisdom, guiding the Muslim community with their profound insights and teachings. The Prophet Muhammad's peace be upon him cousin and son-in-law, Ali ibn Abi Talib, peace be upon him, is considered one of the most learned individuals of his time. His teachings and writings laid the groundwork for many areas of Islamic jurisprudence, theology, and philosophy. Ali's sermons, letters, and sayings are compiled in the famous work Naj al-Balaga, Peak of Eloquence, which is still studied for its deep insights into ethics, governance, and spirituality. Ali's descendants continued this tradition of scholarship. His son, Hassan ibn Ali, peace be upon him, and his grandson, Hussein ibn Ali, peace be upon him, are venerated not only for their martyrdom, but also for their intellectual contributions. They were known for their profound knowledge of the Quran, Hadith, and Islamic law, and they played crucial roles in preserving and transmitting the teachings of Islam. The Shia tradition, in particular, places great emphasis on the twelve imams, who are believed to be the rightful successors to the Prophet Muhammad. These imams are considered infallible and divinely guided, and their contributions to Islamic scholarship are immense. Imam Muhammad al-Baqir, peace be upon him, the fifth imam, is known for his extensive knowledge of Islamic law and theology. He established a prominent school in Medina, where he taught numerous students, including some of the most respected scholars of his time. His efforts helped systematize and codify Islamic jurisprudence, laying the foundation for later developments in Islamic legal theory. Imam Jafar al-Sadiq, peace be upon him, the sixth imam, is perhaps the most influential of the imams in terms of scholarly contributions. He is credited with founding the Jafari school of thought in Shia Islam, which remains one of the main legal schools in Shia jurisprudence. Imam Jafar al-Sadiq's teachings encompassed a wide range of subjects, including theology, philosophy, natural sciences, and medicine. He was a contemporary of many notable scholars, including Abu Hanifa and Malik ibn Anas, who founded their own schools of thought in Sunni Islam. Imam Jafar al-Sadiq's interdisciplinary approach and emphasis on reason and empirical observation influenced subsequent Islamic thinkers and scientists. Members of the Ahli al-Bayt were also pioneers in the fields of medicine and the natural sciences. Ali ibn Musa al-Ridha, peace be upon him, the eighth imam, wrote extensively on medical subjects. His treatise, Risalat al dahabiya the Golden Treatise, covers various aspects of medical knowledge, including anatomy, pathology, and pharmacology. The treatise emphasizes the importance of hygiene, diet, and preventive medicine, reflecting a holistic approach to health that was ahead of its time. Imam al-Ridha's contributions to medicine were part of a broader Islamic tradition of scientific inquiry. During the Islamic Golden Age, Many scholars from the Ahli al-Bayt and their followers made significant advances in various scientific fields. The translation movement, which saw Greek, Persian, and Indian scientific texts translated into Arabic, was supported by members of the Ahli al-Bayt, who recognized the value of integrating knowledge from different cultures into the Islamic intellectual tradition. The Ahili al-Bayt's contributions to Islamic philosophy and mysticism are also noteworthy. Imam Ali ibn Abi Talib,
peace be upon him, is often regarded as one of the earliest Muslim philosophers. His emphasis on the use of reason and his reflections on metaphysics and ethics influenced later Islamic philosophers such as Al-Farabi, Avicenna, Ibn Sina, and Averroes, Ibn Rushd. In the realm of mysticism, or Sufism, the Aheli al-Bayt's spiritual legacy is profound. Many Sufi orders trace their spiritual lineage back to Ali ibn Abi Talib, peace be upon him, viewing him as the fountainhead of esoteric knowledge. The teachings of the imams, particularly those of Imam Ali and Imam Jafar al-Sadiq, peace be upon them, have deeply influenced Sufi thought and practice. Their emphasis on inner purification, the love of God, and the pursuit of spiritual knowledge resonate strongly with Sufi ideals. The literary contributions of the Aheli al-Bayt are also significant. Their eloquence and mastery of the Arabic language are evident in their sermons, letters, and poetry. The literary works attributed to them are not only valued for their theological and philosophical content, but also for their linguistic beauty and rhetorical power. Zainab bint Ali, peace be upon her, the sister of Hussein ibn Ali, peace be upon him, is renowned for her eloquent speeches, particularly those delivered after the Battle of Karbala. Her powerful oratory and unwavering defiance in the face of oppression have made her a symbol of resistance and resilience in Islamic culture. The contributions of the Ahili al-Bayt to science and scholarship have left an indelible mark on Islamic civilization. Their emphasis on knowledge, reason, and ethical conduct has inspired generations of Muslim scholars and thinkers. The institutions and traditions they established continue to shape Islamic thought and practice to this day. In summary, the Aheli al-Bayt's impact on science and scholarship is vast and multifaceted. From their foundational role in Islamic jurisprudence and theology, to their advancements in medicine, natural sciences, philosophy, and literature, the legacy of the Prophet's family is integral to the intellectual heritage of Islam. Their contributions not only advanced the frontiers of knowledge in their time, but also laid the groundwork for future generations to build upon.